This is El Jadida on Morocco's Atlantic coast, the best spot in the world to find red algae in the wild. Every day between July and September, Khadija and her family come here to harvest the precious seaweed. It's a good source of income for her, even though a kilo doesn't always sell at the same price. 50, 70 or 80 cents a kilo, but this year the price is low. Out of the plant comes agar, an all-natural gelatinous substance used as an ingredient in many food products and desserts. But today, the Moroccan red algae is under threat because of over-exploitation. People don't respect quotas and stocks are unable to renew themselves. In just five years, the amount of algae found here has dropped 40%. In some places there is nothing left, the algae is all gone, but I'm more concerned with people getting by. Divers have responsibilities, they have to pay rent, water, electricity. We realize what is happening, but what else can we do? Do you think about the environment or about you first? Brahim keeps on diving 15 meters below to harvest red algae. Together with fish, it's his only source of income. If there's no algae left, we'll have to start stealing. There's no alternative. Our job is the sea, we have no other job. With few options, divers are caught in a vicious net. The disappearance of a precious plant and the loss of a way of life and livelihood.